Hey, how's everyone doing today? I'm playing Bevanchule. It is a game on Kickstarter right now. Um, so, it's an RPG style game. I'll show you. I, so, I've played quite a bit of it so far. Uh, this is just the demo, of course. I don't have a full copy. I'm going to skip all the reading. Um, I've already read it. I'll let you guys play it, read it, what's going on. But essentially you play as this one character who uh, has fled his homeland and has uh, his ship crashed and he landed up here. No one believes he's actually from that homeland because apparently it was supposedly uninhabitable. Uh, well, he's here and his ship was wrecked and the main objective of this uh, intro here is to, you know, discover his shipwreck and stuff like that. Figure out what has happened to everyone else that was on the ship. So during the during I call it tutorial during the um, demo, you get these three characters. Uh, they all have traditional. You have your healer, your assassin. I would say he's probably more like a tank, probably more like a fighter almost, yeah, a little bit in between. So during this video I'll also um, cut the video and jump to other points just to get, because I want to show you some key stuff in this. Make sure you get the, the main stuff, make sure I touch on everything. That is at least touchable in this. Blah 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 blah. As I said, I've played through the entire entire uh, thing here. It's actually really good. I like it. Okay. So start out going this way. Let me see where I'm at in the map here. Um. We'll start out this way because I don't think there's anything that way. So there is resources we can collect, like this rock right here. They glow when they get close to them. Where am I at here? Where am I at? We're gonna go back this way real quick. We'll head to the we'll head to that little village here soon. Um, let's get in a little combat scene so I can show you a little bit what it's like. So yeah, it's not like an open world combat. It is a tactical RPG. Um, Myself have using like a grid system. A lot of them do. You have free range of motion. You have your attack skills, items, and your turn. So, I'm just going to go right up on this guy and apparently not attack him. Uh, let's see if any of my skills reach. No, no skills reach. So, unturn with him. Oh, I didn't even realize there's a guy behind us. So, yeah, we have the turn based. This guy can go over here. We'll attack him. Send this guy back. This guy obviously super weak because he's just like our healer. He does get some pretty good attacks later on. Uh, throughout this, you can get up to level five with your characters. Um, and I'll explain a little bit about what is. Wow. Okay. Uh, just like every other, there's status effects. Um, I didn't get it this time, but you can get poisoned by these little drones. So those effects from what I've seen only last through that combat. They don't go in once you leave combat. At least for now. This is a pre-alpha demo 1.3. So yeah, now after I attack I still have the option to keep moving. You always have the option to move and perform either healing or attack or your skill. Uh, let's see, this guy have a skill I can use right now. Yeah, gut punch. It's not much, but... Boom. So now you have an idea what the skills look like. Um, nope, he's not doing anything other than going to end his turn. i make sure I keep an eye on my health because there's times I show this game off to some people at school the other day and they just watch me die because I wasn't paying attention. Oh yeah. 
So here's some birds you can grab. I'm gonna try to avoid that spider here real quick. I just wanna see if there's a chest in here. There we go, I need that too. Wild thistle. Come over here and grab this iron ore. As far as I know, there's only the three resources you can three major resources you can collect right now. Um, there is a crafting system. I do not believe it's in here yet. If it is, I have yet to see it. Um, I don't quite know what this will looks like itself. I should have looked at it. So let's just look real quick and see if there is a crafting system. So here you have your stats, inventory, equipment skills. Um, let's save stuff. Inventory. Let's see if I click on iron. Yeah, no, you can't can't do any crafting right now. Yep. Uh, I'll show you skills later when I level up. Oh, think as much I can. Nope, nope, nope. Not avoiding that one. Okay. So we only have the two two baddies here. Come on, 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 come on. Nope. Okay. Cool. Whatever. I'm just gonna move them all up close. Let's get it going here. Yeah, so now you can see who they're attacking. So this guy's right here using Vicious Bite. Um, this guy right here. I'm not gonna try to pronounce names because I am not good at these names. Actually, probably more so just the main character here. I don't I don't care to move. There's some guys I definitely will move for, but these little little things uh, don't care too much to move for. There is two bosses in this. One of them is like the main storyline boss to the uh, demo. One of them is a side boss. Um, much harder though. Uh, right now, the developers are on their Kickstarter page. Now between, I believe it's, oh, and maybe, may, I believe it's Friday. Um, you can get entered in to win a cloth map of the game uh, by showing the showing that you have beaten one of the bosses and then if you do the other one you can show them for more point for more entries for ones like two one seven something like that you get more entries into it it's pretty cool it's one of the Kickstarter uh, rewards if you um, go that high so let's just keep going here. Get some iron ore. Uh, there's also some little missions in this too. Uh, not just, you know, combat. They do have a couple people requesting items and stuff like that. Which is part of the reason why I'm collecting. Okay. Take on this little drone right here. Drone first. Nope. Ah, uh, see, look at that. I'm poorly observing my guys here it's crazy because I <laughs> I played this through the first time I never died once until I got to the first boss I feel like I'm dying every two seconds oh you're gonna run and hide not gonna help you See, look at that. Stayed within my range, little harvest man. You know what he reminds me of? Those are the little spiders from Jumanji. 
the original Jumanji, not the, not the new one. I haven't seen it. Man, stop running. Cool, so we leveled up. We got a shiny tool from it. I don't know what those do either. Let's check this out real quick. Atonian artifact, as always. So, skills. Um, you didn't level up. So we'll go over here. You have your little skill tree. Uh, not really much of a tree, I guess. You have your skills. Um, AP, what you have, how much you can actually use. So we have 5 AP to spend. I'm actually going to buy... Oh boy. Yeah, we're going to buy that one. So it costs us... There you go. And we only have six left. We don't really have anything else we can buy. No, nope, five, three, three. Yeah, no, we have nothing else we can buy for this guy. Let's go back, check him. And we have five to spend. <sighs> this is actually what I bought the first time last time, so I'm going to stick to it because I like it. Anything else I can buy costs three. It costs two. Um, no, that's five. That's what I should have bought. I'm taking me to knock, knock back. Cool. So now there's, that's the skills. You see how that works. Um, as of right now, you're unable to upgrade skills in this one. Uh, it should be indefinitely, obviously, in the later one. For now, I'm going to skip ahead, level up, find some more stuff, and I'll get back to you guys. Okay, guys. Well, uh, there's not much more left for me to show you. It's a pretty great game. Uh, there's some demo stuff. Great game first, some demo stuff. Skip through this, blah, blah, blah. So this is part of his shipwreck, or what is believed to be his shipwreck. I spent a lot of time exploring the map. I'm still not, it's been about two hours exploring the map. Uh, still not max level yet because I, you know, I ignored a lot of fights. Uh, I was just searching, I was item hunting, trying to find specific items. Doing some of the quests, stuff like that. So it's a good thing I didn't play it all for you, because otherwise, woo, it'd be a long video. And this isn't a live stream. If it was a live stream, it'd be worth two hours. Found some cool little hidden stuff. Um, those little secret caves where certain special items are set. You can buy a lot of the items at the black market. If you gain access to the black market. Um, so I think that's about it. I'll probably call it quits here. Well, uh, get the game. Back on Kickstarter, it's wonderful. See you next time.